Welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be talking to you about if there's going to be a team of the year market crash, when the lowest points are going to be, but also when the highest points are going to be. So first of all, before we get into the video, make sure you do subscribe. We are aiming for 13,000 subscribers and I'm also making around two videos a day, so you definitely don't miss them. So going straight into the video now, this is going to be a bit complicated. I'm going to go quite deep into the market and how it kind of works, everything, how the fluctuation works, every single market crash other stuff like that and mainly answering some frequently asked questions and comments that are usually left so it's going to be a bit of a different video to the other team of the year ones but this one's definitely going to be helpful if not one of the most helpful ones that have released for team of the year and any other market crash as well so the first one that some people do actually say is about black friday a black friday market crash nothing really happened and the market actually went up that's why of course everyone was quite confused if this team of the year is going to be the same situation where it goes up other stuff like that so i'm going to be answering this question now so first of all you do need to understand of course the black friday market crash it did actually go down a lot even though it did go up after so what i mean by that the panic selling for black friday was absolutely huge we did see like a week before actually black friday that there was of course my hd gamers video made a lot of panic selling that was only like a day or two before black friday but for everyone like kind of looking from a trader's point of view that is still black friday from everyone else who doesn't really understand the market too much who are leaving comments saying that the market actually went up during Black Friday, they don't understand that the Black Friday, the, the whole market crash starts way before Black Friday even is released and even starts at 6 p.m. on Friday. So for example, Black Friday market crash, it's obviously called the crash before the crash, but some people don't really understand this. This happens like a week or two before any market crash and that is still counted as Black Friday or as team of the year. So when I'm referring to the team of the year market crash, you do need to mainly understand that this is going to be the crash before the crash, which is going to be a week or two in advance for Team of the Year. Team of the Year, the market is probably going to be at its lowest, just like Black Friday, before Team of the Year, before any card is released, before anything about Team of the Year is really talked about. It is going to be around a week before, maybe even a few days. This is all going to depend on the following factors. The main factors for this is going to be a huge thing that happens is, of course, my HD Gamer. Other huge YouTubers are going to start talking about team of the year that's it's going to cause some panic selling because in my opinion it's going to be just like black friday panic selling is going to make this team of the year market crash it's going to be the soul around it the mainly this team of the year market crash is going to be building around panic selling and things that causes panic selling are of course any videos by huge youtubers also any tweets from ea sports like hyping it up or maybe if a vote is released just like fifa 18 that will cause some panic selling if you don't know what i mean by a vote it's kind of like all of these huge youtubers get these kind of boxes this is what happened last year in FIFA 18 they got these kind of boxes where they can vote for their team of the year and of course every single one of them made loads of videos this is the Nepenthes, A9 skills, my HD gamer all of their like kind of viewers all of their audience is getting this everyone knows team of the year is coming and that is going to cause lots and lots of panic selling also when some websites for example Footbin they might change it up for a team of the year theme something like that this is all going to cause panic selling and another huge thing as well is kind of the login screen this recently happened in fifa 19 where we kind of get like daily updates on the login screen before we log into fifa 19 ultimate team when that changes to team of the year that is going to create loads and loads of hype because ea sports always like to put nice graphics on there but if you do keep up with all of these videos even leave comments that reply to every single comment eventually it might take a day or two but that should keep you set just make sure you leave a comment if you don't understand or anything i'll definitely help you out if you stick to watching this kind of team of the year market series you'll definitely Definitely be okay. Thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you next time.